Chimpanzee versus Hyena Who would win a fight between these two animals? We share 98% of our genetic DNA with chimpanzees, making them one of our closest living relatives. Like us, chimpanzees are hominids, or great apes, of which there are eight living species in four genera. Homo, of which only we humans remain, Pongo, Bornean Sumatran and Tapanuli orangutans, Gorilla, Eastern and Western gorillas, and Pan, chimps and bonobos. The hyena, family hyenidae, also spelled hyena, is any of three species of coarse fur dog-like carnivores found in Asia and Africa that are known for their scavenging habits. Let's find out more about their appearance. Chimpanzees come in a wide range of sizes and appearances, but standing upright, they measure about 3 to 5.5 feet, 1 to 1.7 meters tall, and weigh between 70 and 130 pounds, 32 and 60 kilograms. Males typically have a larger, more robust body than females. Chimpanzees are covered by a coat of brown or black hair, but their faces are bare except for a short white beard. Skin is typically white, with the exception of the hands, feet, and face, which can all be black. Younger animals may have pale or pinkish faces. Among older males and females, the forehead often becomes bald and the back becomes gray. Hyenas have long forelegs and a powerful neck and shoulders, allowing them to dismember and carry prey. Hyenas are tireless trotters with excellent vision, hearing, and smell for locating carrion, as well as skilled hunters. All hyenas are mostly active at night. Spotted hyenas are ginger-colored with unique patterns of dark spots, and females are larger than males. They can weigh up to 180 pounds, 82 kilograms. Now let's see where they live. Chimpanzees are found in many parts of Eastern and Central Africa. Each subspecies has a distinct range. The Western subspecies ranges from Southern Senegal to Western Ghana. Unsurprisingly, the Nigeria Cameroon subspecies is found in parts of Nigeria and Cameroon. The Central subspecies ranges from Southern Cameroon to the Western tip of the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Finally, the eastern subspecies is primarily found in the Democratic Republic of the Congo and the Central African Republic. These primates live in a variety of ecosystems. Different subspecies prefer various habitat types. Others live in savannas, grasslands, woodlands, or chaparral, while some live in tropical rainforests or scrub forests. Many also live in mountainous regions up to 9,000 feet elevation. Africa, south of the Sahara Desert, is home to spotted hyenas. They can survive in savannas and swamps, as well as semi-arid and mountainous forest areas. Adult spotted hyenas prefer to sleep in holes or shallow pools, under bushes or scrubs, or anywhere else they can find shade during the day. Watering holes are used by hyenas to cool off or hide extra food. Spotted hyenas can be active at any time of day or night, depending on their needs and the presence of humans, but they are mostly active at night. Now let's see what they eat and how they hunt. After descending from their night nests in the trees, they feast on fruits, their primary diet, as well as leaves, buds, and blossoms. Their feeding becomes more selective after a while, and they will select the ripest fruit. They pick fruit with their hands most of the time, but they eat berries and seeds directly off the stem with their lips. Their diet consists of up to 80 different plant foods and they will forage for food for six to eight hours per day. They will occasionally supplement their diets with meat, such as young antelopes or goats. Other primates, such as young baboons, colobus monkeys, and blue monkeys, are their most common victims. In overlapping territories, lions and hyenas compete for the same food. 
Sometimes the hyenas do the work of organizing, chasing down, and killing prey only to have lions steal it. Spotted hyenas can chase lions away from a kill in large groups. However, the hyena's impressive hunting abilities come into play during a hunt. They can chase down prey over long distances while running at speeds of up to 60 kilometers per hour, 37 miles per hour. Spotted hyenas frequently pick out the weak or young in the herd, but they can also kill healthy adult ungulates. What they hunt depends on numbers. The bigger the hyena clan, the larger its prey. This can include young rhinos, adult wildebeest, zebras, and Cape buffalo. When hunting such large prey, hyenas hunt in groups, and young hyenas take years to become successful. Smaller groups pursue gazelles, impalas, warthogs, and waterbucks. When hunting alone, a spotted hyena may go after smaller prey. Ground birds, rabbits, spring hare, bat-eared foxes, porcupines, jackals, and fish are all possibilities. Let's review the last chapter and see how do they behave in the wild. The chimp is the closest living relative to humans. They are intelligent, curious, loud, and social. Chimps live in loose communities that can range from 10 to more than 100 individuals. They can share a home range that they defend from intruders and will forage for food in groups at times. They exhibit complex patterns of behavior, many of which are learned and are capable of solving problems, planning for anticipated events, and trying to make and use tools. They've even been spotted using medicinal plants to treat a variety of ailments. Chimps frequently touch each other and may kiss when they meet. They also hold hands and groom each other. Wailing calls, howling screams, and the well-known laughter, which can be heard up to five kilometers, three miles away, are all used by hyenas to alert other clan members of a food source. They usually have two to four cubs in a litter. Around the age of one year, cubs begin to accompany their mothers on their hunting and scavenging expeditions. Until then, they are left behind at the den with a babysitting adult. It's time to move on to more serious things. Who will win a one-on-one -on -one fight between a chimpanzee and a hyena? Chimps are predators, but they aren't very good ones. It is common for several chimps to kill another chimp or even a small monkey. When it comes to predators on the African plains, spotted hyenas are second only to lions. Hyenas, contrary to popular belief, are skilled hunters. With their powerful jaws, these creatures have been known to take down anything smaller than a zebra. Chimps are strong when you consider that most animals the size of humans or around the same level have similar if not greater strength than two men. Strength isn't the only factor in this scenario, and it's nearly meaningless. Jaws are more dangerous than blunt force trauma and grabbing. Hyenas have stronger bite forces than lions and are skilled predators, in comparison to chimps who typically target the face and groin of other chimps, they instinctively know to target vital points on other animals. Despite their strength, chimps have a fatal evolutionary flaw. Their skin, similar to that of humans, is very close to the muscle. They bleed easily and quickly. They don't go into shock as quickly as humans and can take trauma much better, but they can still bleed to death just as easily. If the hyena bites the chimp repeatedly, the consequences will be devastating. The chimp may strike the hyena on the head in a fit of rage and fear, causing some damage, but hyenas are quite tough for their small stature. Surviving devastating leopard and lion attacks is not uncommon. The chimpanzee is more intelligent, and this can be an advantage in a fight. Their main predators are leopards, which they have been known to attack and kill in groups. Spotted hyenas fight leopards all the time, and sometimes win. While hyenas cannot always beat full-grown male leopards on their own, they can easily beat smaller ones. So, if hyenas can kill leopards, leopards can kill chimps, 
you can figure out how this fight ends. In a one-on-one -on -one fight, the hyena can and will kill the chimp. Being larger and more powerful gives the hyena the edge, and if it gets in one good bite, the chimpanzee would be done for. In closing, the chimp could definitely injure the hyena, but the end result would be a hyena with a bitten up face, but the ape would finish dead. The hyena compared to the chimp is a true predator. If you liked this video, how about a more fair fight between a chimpanzee and a grey wolf, or even against a kangal? What do you think? I await your opinion in the comments. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Until next time, farewell.